Hey YouTubers, it's time to introduce you to a big update of our best seller. YouTube Essential Graphics, more than 5,000 sales, winner of Best Project Top 20. This pack contains all you need to make your videos look more stylish and professional. There are more than 230 plus ready-made compositions that suit any channel theme. 22 categories included openers, transitions, lower thirds, subscribes, elements, and more. It's easy to edit compositions with one click. Change duration of any shot, edit texts and customize colors so it matches your identity. Chose your style to be unique. Design your videos and YouTube profile. The project included PSD layouts with cover, user pick, and thumbnails to make your channel looks pro. See our other projects to make unique content and save your time. Hello! Congrats! You have get a nice YouTube Essential Library Pack from EasyEdit.Pro. Let's see what is inside this pack. Tutorial folder contains, how to use, video and all links you need. Here is a catalog of all scenes, open it for navigation. All the scenes are grouped with categories. You can see a preview of all scenes and catalog using scene names. Project Files contains all scenes, sounds and stickers. Here are the links to the used fonts, they need to be installed for pack work correctly. Also pack includes a vector file with graphics, you can use it for channel branding or another way you like. Let's install Outback into DaVinci Resolve. Now! Open DaVinci Resolve. Before we start we need to set up our project settings. Set the full HD frame size and 30 frames per second. Go to Project Files, Folder and Find, DRFX File. Then open DaVinci Resolve and go to Fusion Page, there is a switch on the bottom of the window. Then just drag the DRFX file into the DaVinci and press install button. After this action scenes will be available in DaVinci Resolve. Use search and effect library to find our scenes, just type EE underscore 39 underscore and they will appear. Use drag and drop to add scenes to the timeline. 
All controls are in inspector on the right. To install sound FX we need to open DaVinci Resolve. Open a sound library tab in the top left corner. Now we need to add our folder with sounds, hit three dots button and click add library. And choose sound FX folder from project files. Now use search tab to find easy edit sound FX, type EE and double click to play the sound. Drag and drop sounds to timeline and you ready to go. Let's see how to use stickers. All stickers are presented in PNG sequences in separate folders. To add stickers to your project go to Media Pool tab. Then select all PNG files of the sticker folder and drag them to the Media Pool. The sticker will import a sequence and it's ready to use. Just drop it on the timeline. I want to add a beautiful video. Now make this video complete with a nice title. This one is OK. Almost all titles in the pack are responsive, you can adjust at length. To customize the scene open inspector, it contains all settings. I will make a quick editing with this title. Go to settings tab to change a size and position of scene. Looks amazing. Openers are fixed length. Opener 3 and 4 are imported on timeline 5 seconds duration, make them longer to see all animation. Let's make an intro to our blog. Let's make some changes. Here is a nice place to use transition. After import transition can be make shorten for comfortable use. Then add marker in the middle of transition composition, it helps in use a lot. Transition Maker video looks more smooth and professional.
sweet. Here I have a video example, I have made it using YouTube Essential Pack Elements. Let's make a final video render to put it on our blog channel. We need to switch to the Deliver tab. On the top you can find a presets for quick export to different source. I will make a custom output settings. I suggest you to use QuickTime preset with H264 codec. Hit add render queue and start rendering the video. That's it, the video is ready.